this is what we are advising every car owner should do right so early in the morning we believe that uh, it's not a wish for any car owner to spend money or so much money on a vehicle right so these are some of the simple tips that will help you to save a lot of the money in the near future now uh, this is a nissan right so it, even though what i'm about to tell you happens or applies to almost every uh, gasoline car right so any car that uses fuel and then maybe any different type of car uh, you have to apply this tip to that to save a lot of money in the near future now uh in the morning early in the morning this is coming from personal experience so this is what i saw this morning now you can see that this car is a little bit dirty right so nissan extra 2012 model okay every morning what i do is i start the car right so let me face this battery here and then start the car so before you even move your car we'll be very glad if you can have some small time and then uh, start your car in the morning so start it and leave it as it is so let's see how oh, just wait a second and see what i'm about to show you uh, start start the car then so this car travels a lot right so as i consider it's a little bit dirty okay let's go start all right so a second let me see to my terminal here i'm coming okay let me tighten this thing a little bit so that it can easily start here. okay start let me see it's still not working okay a second see the terminal i have to tighten this terminal way okay let's go hold on a second so you should be very careful when you are facing some of these uh, problems here, right? So these are some very critical issues. You should always check your terminal. And then we normally remove this battery terminal because I only use this car when I'm going on a, a long journey, right? So sometimes I'll remove the battery, then put it down. Let's go. Okay, I'm coming. Finally, uh, I've started a car, right? So this is what I'm trying to say. Now, once you start the car in the morning, just leave it down. So I would suggest that maybe either uh, you leave it and go and take your shower and then come back. Why is this very, very important? Okay, so let me see. You can see that it's my best that is making such a noise. So press on the gas, right? So if you have no idea about how to press the gas here, you can press that inside world, the car. Just press on world, the accelerator. So let's see what is happening. And then what? Leave it down, right? So leave it down for some few minutes. Just leave the fire on like this. And go and take your shower and come back, right? So maybe you may think that it is going to consume a lot of fuel, but that is not the case. Consuming the fuel, a little bit consuming is better than you damaging your car, right? So what I'm trying to say here, so when you are down, just check the car under. Is there any drop of what? Uh, 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 oil there? Or is there any drop of water? So that, this one, this particular tip here, will save you a lot of money. So what I'm seeing here on this car is uh, there's a water leakage here, right? So who knows? There's a water from the water hose. This is a, this is one of the water hose, and then here's a, another one here, right? That one, obviously, that place is a little bit of uh, rust, obviously. Who knows, if you didn't start a car here, you wouldn't have seen that the water is dropping under uh, uh, this water hose. Now, what are you going to do here? Here, in this particular thing, if you don't know you drive the car with this water leakage under here, I will do that, I will check that for you in a second when I put uh, this fire off or when I turn the engine off, right? So I will show you what I'm trying to say here. This can easily force your car to overheat and then let your gasket bend. In the long run, you have to change the gasket. That will cost you a lot of money. This is what I'm trying to say. The water leakage under this particular thing here can cost you a million, million of those amounts in the near future. So this is a very simple tip here. So make sure that you subscribe to the channel if you haven't. And then uh, make sure that you share this video to your car owners.
today we bring you what, an update on how to save a lot of money on your car services. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more lessons. Thank you for watching.